Now to campaign 2020, and one night after President Trump was impeached, the Democrats who want to replace him are scoring off in their latest debate. The impeachment topic, one of many coming up tonight in this, the sixth and final debate of the year. Just seven candidates on stage tonight in Los Angeles, and CBS 4's Danya Bacchus is there. Not growing as much as in the sixth and smallest debate yet. We need to restore the integrity of the presidency, of the office of the presidency. Democrats vying to unseat President Trump immediately weighed in on his historic impeachment. If the president claims uh, that he is so innocent, then why doesn't he have all the president's men testify? The 2020 presidential candidates spent much of their time trying to set themselves apart. Billionaires in wine caves should not pick the next president of the United States. I am the, literally the only person on this stage who's not a millionaire or a billionaire. Other issues on the minds of voters like climate change also dominated the night. If we are going to treat climate as the threat that it is, we are going to have to partner with the Chinese. We have got to, and I've introduced legislation to do this, declare a national emergency. The Democratic debate took place here in California, a state that offers the biggest prize in the battle for delegates on Super Tuesday in March. Are you willing to commit tonight to running for a second term if you're elected next November? No, I'm not willing to commit one way or another. Here's the deal. I'm not even elected one term yet, and let's see where we are. Despite a historically diverse field, Thursday night's event featured only two women and one candidate of color. It's both an honor and disappointment to be the lone candidate of color on the stage tonight. I miss Kamala, I miss Corey, though I think Corey will be back. The first nominating contest of the 2020 primary season, the Iowa caucuses, is less than two months away. Donya Backus, CBS News, Los Angeles.